Well, this is our last stop in Oklahoma. It's Ed Galloway's um, Totem Pole Park. So come with us, let's go and have a look. We are on the way. This little one here to me looks like it's designed to um, be like a bird bath and uh, water feature. Uh, it does have a bird relief on the front of it, so I'm picking that's what it is. Uh, this totem behind me has. Um, uh, reliefs of uh, some of the um, more well-known Native Americans, one of which is Geronimo. I don't know which one that is, and um, I'm sure Janie will fill in the gaps. Likewise, this one has the reliefs of the, uh, the Indians on it as well. It also has a lot of birds and animals uh, reliefs on the sides as well and it does look like right at the very very top that it's got access for birds to nest and of course the final one is this absolutely massive uh, totem at the back and this is made out of um, concrete and steel Totem. Um, so if you want to read that, then pause the video here. Well, this is inside the very large totem. Now I'll, I'll try to do a walk around the outside and capture as much of it as I possibly can. all the way around at the top it's got all these different motifs as well just absolutely fantastic you must have invested a huge amount of time to, to do this so Ed Galloway uh, he was born in 18, 1880 I believe and he died in 1963 so he lived on the property all of his life and this was a bit of a community effort with regard to the materials so he got paint and things like that from his neighbours he dug up the sand for the cement out of a out of a nearby river and really did his best to provide something meaningful for the um, Native American Indians and of course Oklahoma is basically the end point of the Trail of Tears so if you're ever out in this area I'd definitely come down and have a look at this. Now this is a um, another little little house here that is all done up in the motifs as well and this is the gift shop uh, so you can go in and and buy something or you can just give them a donation so, there we go. all right it um, doesn't take you very long to get in here and read everything um, what would you say you've been here 15 minutes 
Yeah. About 15 minutes, so it is a bit of a, um, a drive off Route 66. It's about um, four miles off Route 66 to get in here. Uh, heading uh, north through to, from Oklahoma through to Missouri. Um, so I, I think it's, it's worthwhile taking the diversion and coming out and having a look and reading everything, even though, like I said, it only takes 15 to 20 minutes to get around it all. Um, we're going to go and have another look now that we've done all the videotaping and yeah, worthwhile coming and seeing, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's nice, you know, it's the biggest totem statue. Pole. Token pole? Yes. Yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching. See you next time.